Hello and welcome to this video about Earth Day, which has been observed since 1970. Over the years, it has become a day of waste cleanup, apocalyptic warnings, and proselytizing about the green agenda. While it is true that we must care for our planet, Earth Day has also been used as a platform to advocate for government coercion, especially regarding private property rights and market arrangements. This is reflected in the term, watermelon environmentalism, which refers to being green on the outside but red on the inside. However, it is important to remember that private property-based market systems provide incentives for owners to take care of the environment. The Property and Environment Research Center, PERC, known as the home of free market environmentalism, is dedicated to harnessing the power of markets and property rights to improve environmental quality. They recognize that conservation is most effective when it is voluntary, cooperative, and makes economic sense. They explore how aligning incentives for environmental stewardship produces sustainable outcomes for land, water, and wildlife. One way that private property rights have always generated incentives to reduce waste is through productive complements. This involves joint products that arise when production processes generate multiple outputs. For example, raising cattle produces both beef and hides as saleable outputs. When the value of hides increases, the added revenue generated from them can absorb a larger share of the costs of raising a steer. Consequently, the revenue from selling the beef must contribute a smaller amount to the cost than before, which benefits producers. They then increase their supply of beef in the process of producing more hides. That increases supply of the other products in the bundle as well, which benefits all those customers by way of greater output and lower prices. Another example is waste reduction. If waste is a part of the bundle of outputs with a negative value, a reduction in waste would increase a producer's profits. Similarly, if one could lower the cost of disposing or treating a given amount of waste, profits would be raised. It would also increase the output of the other joint products, benefiting those consumers as well as the producers. In conclusion, Earth Day is an important reminder to take care of our planet. However, it is crucial to remember that private property-based market systems provide incentives for environmental stewardship. By aligning incentives, we can generate sustainable outcomes for land, water, and wildlife without the need for government coercion. Subscribe Libertarian Facts.